And right now we're tracking breaking news out of Dark County where officials are on the scene of a fatal fire. It happened just before 3 o'clock at a camper off Mansion Road just northwest of Versailles. Brooke Moore joins us live with a breaking update this morning. Brooke? Mansion Road. We're just a little bit away from that scene there, but we have confirmed with Dark County Sheriff's Office that one person has been killed in this camper fire. If you take a look behind me here, we do still have fire officials on the scene. They were expecting the coroner as well. Back there investigating between those trees where that camper was earlier this morning. If you take a look at this video, you'll see uh, what we saw when we first arrived. The flames actually broke out just before 3 o'clock this morning. We talked to Detective Sergeant Mike Burns with the Dark County Sheriff's Office. He says a woman that was living inside the house here on this property looked out the window and saw the camper on fire. She's the one who called 911 and she also told officials that she saw a person inside the camper. That's when firefighters uh, from the Versailles Fire Department came to the scene here, put those flames out quickly, but they say that the person inside that victim was already dead. At this point, they aren't able to tell us if it's a man or a woman, but they did say that the family who lives in the home told officials that a man was living in this small travel camper, and they say that he stays there regularly. He knew the family, but at this point, they aren't saying whether this man is the victim. They are still working to identify the victim, and then they're going to talk to family members. They also have the state fire marshal coming to the scene to try to investigate what may have started those early morning flames. So there is still a lot to this investigation, and we'll continue to follow that and we'll bring you the very latest updates as soon as we get them. Reporting live in Wayne Township, I'm Brooke Moore. Two News Today, working for you.